Hi everyone! In today's video, we're going to be going through 2021 AMC 10A Problem 24. It says that the interior of a quadrilateral is bounded by x plus ay squared is equal to 4a squared and ax minus y squared is equal to a squared, where a is some positive real number. And we're trying to find the area of this region in terms of a. So this problem may seem pretty complicated, but it turns out there's a really simple solution. And it happens by just testing small numbers. For a lot of problems, if you don't know what to do or get stuck, testing small numbers can be really helpful. In this case, we're going to look at a equals 2. Our first equation gives us that x plus 2y squared is equal to 4 times 2 squared, which is 16. And our second equation gives us that 2x minus y squared equals 4. Now, this gives us four different sets of solutions. If we have x plus 2y equals 4, and 2x minus y is equal to 2, we'll see that we have x is equal to 1.6 and y equals 1.2. In our next system of equations, we have x plus 2y equals negative 4 and 2x minus y equals 2. In this system of equations, we have x equals 0 and y equals 2. Sorry, y equals negative 2. We can write another system of equations where we have x plus 2y is equal to 4 and 2x minus y is equal to negative 2. In this system, we have that x is equal to 0 and y equals 2. In our final system of equations, we have x plus 2y equals negative 4 and 2x minus y is equal to negative 2. Here we have x equals negative 1.6 and y equals negative 1.2. These four points create a rectangle. And this technique is con covered in our meta solving video. So if you want to take a look at that, that'll help you understand this problem if you are getting a little bit lost. So now we have our four points and we can apply shoelaces. So by shoelace theorem, I'll leave you to plug in the area, but with these points, it's fairly easy to calculate from shoelace, and you'll see that the area is 6.4. Now, you can plug in to all of these points for a equals 2. You'll see that if a equals 2 here, our denominator will be 9, which is not going to result in 6.4. Here, our denominator will be 3, also wrong. Here, it'll also be 3, which won't work. So our real contenders are option choices D and E. In D, we have 8 times 4 over 5, which is 32 over 5, which is 6.4, which is correct. We can double check E just to be sure. In E, we have 8 times 2, which is 16 over 2 squared plus 1, which is 5. This is 3.2. So our only answer is D. So in this case, what you want to do is try small examples. And that is often the way to go. And we saw that with a small example, we were able to limit our answer choices down to D. And again, if you want to cover this, it's covered. This technique is called engineer's induction, and it's covered in our meta solving video if you want more practice with these types of problems. Thanks for watching. We will be posting much more math content soon, so make sure to like and subscribe so you don't miss out.